Well, the weather forecaster has promised us an agreeable day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you is live action from the Championship. It's Rotherham United, and they take on Coventry City. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Here's a Rotherham United starting lineup. Well, it's a defensive lineup, that's for sure. But their wing backs and at least one of their midfield players will need to break forward when they regain possession, just to give them a threat going forward. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, it's like for like here, so whichever team wins more of the key battles will probably come out on top. I think this should be a tight game. And the match begins. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, there it is, the first caution of this match. Well, he didn't need to make the challenge, did he? He's under pressure now. It's a long time to go in this game. far away but above the crossbar Chief He's going forward well here, but quick thinking defensively. Connor Washington. Plenty of support here. Giving them a different option by moving in field. Crossing into the middle. Well, they can bring it out now. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? And now, passing it. Oh, good save. Keen to take it short here. Could be! In it goes! But it will not stand offside, Stuart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. He's given us away. 
Good technique displayed. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Palmer. Still passing it around with authority. Will it lead to the goal that puts them ahead? In it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? Just restarted, 1-0 here. Cohen Brammel. Richard Wood. And they need to get tighter. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Ben Sheaf. Palmer. Casey Palmer. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. And he takes it on! Well, it could have been a better effort, and I think we were all expecting it would be. Ben Wiles. And he could really get at the opposition. Well, disappointing end to the move. So nearly at half-time, and the home side trailing, albeit not by much. Stuart, your thoughts up to this point? Well, it's been a fairly even first half so far, but they haven't shown enough creativity, particularly in midfield, but there's been too many negative passes. If they can get the ball into the front areas that little bit quicker, I think they'll get back into this. An incisive pass... To square the game! Edge of the seat stuff! Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. Gustavo Hammer. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Casey Palmer. Good looking sequence. Hammer. Can he convert? Making sure it didn't get past him. And there it is, the half-time whistle. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, that's exactly what his team needed because they weren't at their best in the first half. And once again, it shows what a key player he is. Can they build on that in the second 45? to the second half then and these two sides are locked together just can't really choose between them at the moment well he's dicing with trouble here having already been booked 
and he is going to pay the ultimate price. Well, when you're on a yellow card, it was a silly challenge. He just lost his discipline there. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. Beautifully weighted ball. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Superb stop. And they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. It's a short corner. Could be! And a goal! Well, against all the odds, they've hit the front. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Oliver Rathbone. Ogbeni. This is looking threatening. Ben Wiles. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Jonathan Panzo. Now with Hammer. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Now, let's see what they can do here. Hammer. Defensive excellence there. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. This is a message for Alan Roach, that's Sean Alan Maguire. Your wife is waiting for you, thank you. And keeping it out. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. He's driven in the corner. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. In position here to protect the ball. Hugo. A fine use of the ball. He takes aim. And it wasn't taxing for the keeper. Well, they've created very little in the game so far. Unless they can show more goal in that top third of the field, this is going to be a really disappointing day for them. They need to improve and quickly. And they still don't have the ball. That has been a recurring theme. Can he make it count? And a goal! They have it to the lead. Much needed security. Well, here's the replay. 
he does well to find that bit of space in the box and then he shows a lot of composure to finish it off that's a good goal So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Cohen Brammel. How about the cross? Hugo. And using his body to good effect. So the final whistle almost upon us and this is not exactly what the home fans had in mind when they arrived at the ground today, Stuart. Well, they've had no defensive game plan today. The forwards haven't pressed the ball. The midfield players have been outnumbered and there is too much space between the defenders at the back. That's been the problem. Could be! And striking the crossbar. Careless in possession. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. You're absolutely right, Derek. They really struggle to get to grips with the game. They always seem second to the ball, and then just a few mistakes at the back, and it's cost them. Poor performance all round. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him.